Alrighty, folks. What's up? Yeah, I like that front cover of Call of the Wild. Looked pretty good. Uh, I just uh, I wasn't I wasn't really digging the uh, the background for HD. This one, this I've always I've always liked this cover. Welcome to the stream, everybody. December seventh. Alrighty, the tournament's about to start here in one minute. And uh, yeah, welcome, Frederico. Thank you so much for hanging out. I uh, I'm one of your hosts tonight, Marco. I also go by Jaded Hesher on Twitch. Uh, just to give you a little uh, background, Quarter World, you know, uh, we're an arcade in Portland. Uh, we got a couple bars in here. We're a barcade, as they say. And uh, lots of different games. Oh, it's 6 o'clock. And that means you can see me. Hey. So uh, we're getting everyone ready here. We're about to start. And uh, taking a look at everything. It looks good. Awesome. Just kind of worried about the quality. This is literally the biggest Twitch event we have done yet. We pulled out all the stops. Uh, hopefully it's going to be very entertaining tonight for y'all. And uh, we got a lot of people who traveled far and wide to be here in Oregon for this tournament. So that's awesome. Pretty good turnout. Uh, yeah, thank you so much. Please, please uh, check us out. Yeah, we uh, we got lots of games. We got pinball, you know, some rare stand-up uh, cabinets. Uh, and we do all kinds of tournaments. We're actually going to go into game one and check them out right now. See what they're doing. This might be friendly right here. I'm going to want to hear some sound. Let's, let's check in and see what they're doing. Just finishing up a little friendly game right there, looks like. Very nice. Let's kind of go through it. We have three stations tonight, two of which are being broadcasted. Uh, this is station one. This is actually on the, um, the stage. This is station number two. And uh, just kind of give you a well, look, see, this is uh, this is the space right here. This is everyone attending. If you look in the little corner over there to the right, we got a bunch of prizes we're gonna give out too. Oh. All right. Looks like we're assembling everybody. And we also got another camera that's like the interview camera where we, we're gonna cruise around on the floor with a, a mic and a cameraman and uh, interview people as they uh, go on to play and come off and all that. We are using uh, a bracket system uh, from challenge.com. Post the link here in a second. Uh, we uh, we do have that feed. That that's going to be the handheld feed. That's going to be me running around. Uh, so you'll be able to see that. So that's that's the one camera you haven't seen yet. Yeah, I, I kind of threw together a uh, little makeshift handheld deal out of uh, sound equipment. Uh, it's kind of funky. Here, I'll I'll show you. Prizes are like what? Like, uh, uh, we got that 
big marquee over there, you might want to take the handheld over at some point and show them that. Actually, since we got some time. It sounds like we're getting the bracket started. Uh, Marco over here is, meanwhile, grabbing our little handheld cam, and he's going to bring it over to the uh, table. And uh, give everyone a nice look at that grand prize marquee. Our host has everyone waving to the cameras right now. We'll try and get a list of the prizes up here in a little in a little bit. As far as what we'll be looking at today, we've got our first cabinet. This is the one that is on stage. We'll be watching that. We'll also be watching our downstage cabinet too. Unfortunately, that third cabinet we do not have a feed on. Go over here to our live cam. Emily making the uh, announcements. We are uh, waiting on Zach, our second contestant there. He comes up to the stage. Let's get live on that game cam. Day to go hunt. That's one. Got it. You got one. You got it. Got another. Reload. Got it.
everybody in the chat. Thanks for joining us. We, uh, we're running around getting a lot of different uh, things set up here, so we're not uh, necessarily... over to our live cam here. Check out what's going on There's on that. There's another. Another. Bit of a weighted game going on there. Let's get back There's to our main another. event. Yeah. Happening on game two here. There, the nail, but yeah. Microphone here. We're testing out. We'll see how this one works. Yeah, it's been the biggest problem we've had around here is with microphones and the sound. But at least we got that game sound. Sounds nice and clear.
Pick a spot. Everybody, it looks like we are back in business with the microphone situation. We able to talk to you again. Your illustrious host Marco should be settling in here soon. He's he, he's the one that's actually going to be walking you through this uh, tournament. Anybody's game here on one. Oh no, that is not the time when you want to be shooting a doe. My goodness, Kirby. That is not going to help you at all. one, but I don't think that's going to be enough to do it, Kirby. I think, uh, I think you might have lost your first strike there. Let's go over to game two now and see what's happening there. Wormhole bonus! If anybody's trying to follow along at home, we are on bracket loop. Bracket loop. Just kind of in between games here on both sets. To have a look at the crowd. There's Marco down there with our floor cam. Let's go over and see what kind of what he can capture for us. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot all about the host. We do have a host cam here. Let's take a look in there. Hi there. 
There's our little HQ off here to the side where we're running things from. Marco's going to be taking over for me here in a little bit. Uh, much more interesting to look at the game, so let's go back to that. All right, folks, we've got our contestants up on set up, set up one. We're going to stay tuned into this one for its entirety. Let everyone here know what's going on with our bracket currently. Uh, we're using bracket. You know, it's actually surprisingly difficult. We're doing a triple strike tournament here. Uh, and uh, it's difficult to find a site or a program that will host a triple strike. Um, so we ended on bracket loop. And right now we're uh, having some technical difficulties on their end. Uh, trying to connect our... Uh, our bracket online. So as soon as we have that information, we will put it up so you can follow along. There's one. There's another. There's another. Got another. You got them all. A bit of an inconsequential bonus round here. Skydive bonus! The 
looking good. All right, once again, we're in between matches on all of our machines right now. We also have a high score tournament going on the Big Buck World back there. I'm sure you can see it. Um, we'll have to check in on that in a little while to see uh, where it's at. Some great competitors there. All right, so we've got our names called for the next round. Uh, we'll come into setup one. We're going to ride that stage setup most of the day, and uh, we'll check in on the other two periodically. Well, let's see if we got our competitors up yet. Actually, we'll jump right over here to two because they're getting themselves started quicker. Big Buck HD. That gentleman on the left, I know he served me a damn fine drink yesterday. Bartender here on the block. Portoril here has a, uh, a drink today named after the Kudu. It is the Kudu Libre. Dark Kraken rum with uh, Coca-Cola and lime. The Kudu Libre. They also have a... Uh, Marco, did you get one of the Mooseitos yet? Pick a spot. There's one! Whoop! That's one! You nailed it! Got another! You nailed it! Got it! Oh! Got him! Man, those, those wild, wild trophies, what are they called again? Dangerous trophies. They get me every time. I'd say I'm, I'm, uh, I'm about a 70% skill level on this game. There's one. Yeah. I'm let Marco slide in here. I think Marco, we, you, are you good at this game? You got You're going to shoot real guns there, right? Oh. Yeah, probably. Probably. Uh -oh. All right, folks. And we're still waiting for our contestants on game one. So we'll just stay right here until uh, they show up. go. I just want to say, the man on the left, Zach, he is awesome. He's my buddy. He makes the best deep fried one. mozzarella sticks Three in town. One. There's another. Yeah. There's another. 
Fubu re-raise. Right, folks, we got a whole dr uh, drink menu for this event, actually. I'd have to say Pappy's Jug is my favorite, though. Folks, we're going to go into the first station here. We got our next game. Check this out. Pick a spot. That's one. We got a doe. He's out. That sucks. There's another. You got it. That's one. We got another doe down. Doe down, doe down.
there you have it. That was a great round. And here's Emily, the uh hear that all right we got our next players for machine one coming up Alright, here we go. This is the hardest part of the game, folks. Right here. Lots of skill. Alright, here we go. We got Kitten Up and Mal. Alright, here we go. Pick a spot. Oh, 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 oh,
All right, and that's way better than Duck Hunt. That dog ain't laughing at me. It's awesome. All right, and that was that. We're going to go tune in to the shaky cam. Let's check out the shaky cam. <laughs> All right, we're just going to check in game two real quick here. And looks like we're getting some names. All right, folks. Here we go. Don't shoot a doe. Cup holder for you right there. You want to, uh, Aww. awesome, awesome. Thank you. You can stay right where you're at. I got nothing to say on this thing, man. <laughs> well, no, stay on. testing hey I'm back can you hear me I can hear me everybody out there hear me oh yeah all right so we've got have we gotten a, uh, an update on what the bracket looks like yet yeah I believe uh, we we're on the last round of or uh, no two more games of this round okay I'm all pretty right. sure that's what I heard all right we've got uh, we've got some house favorites it sounds like uh, 
in the chat there. I'm rooting for the Tuesday pinball crew. I think they're they're looking at, at you <laughs> and maybe uh, Emily. Yeah. So we, str we stream here on Tuesdays on Twitch, a, a little pinball hangout, for those of you that know. Unfortunately, we didn't do that this okay. last Tuesday. Where that game sound up? I like this one. Yeah. Right player. Right. Who's that? Let me see the. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's go pop into uh, game number two here. See what they're up to. Uh, now I, I I do not know these contestants' names, but I was watching uh, the young lady there on the left. She was cleaning up on the main one earlier, so I keep an eye out for her. I'm seeing uh, a lot of the uh, the drinks, uh, the special drinks for the event tonight in people's hands. That's good. Yeah, they seem to be they seem to be moving. I I, I tried one of those uh, moose moose moosehitos finally. Yeah, I'm sad that uh, my little uh, contribution as uh, audio as motherfucker didn't make it, but oh well. Did you try one of those retro haze yet? You drinking one of those uh, Quarter World Zone Retro Haze IPA? Yeah, Retro Haze. You know, not bad. I uh, had one the other day. It was it was great. It was smooth, refreshing. Uh, you know, everything I look for in a, a beer. It, they call it juicy. Yeah, That's definitely. They, they call them now. They call them juicies. All right, I guess that was it, huh? All right. Big Buck me out there is rooting for Kirby. I'll, I'll put some money on Kirby. Oh, definitely. Looks like we're going to a, a little break here. All right, we're going to take a little 10-minute break here in the action. Maybe we'll check on what that uh, high score is on the Big Buck World so far. See if we can see from here. And uh, don't forget while you're here to... Uh, like us, subscribe to us, follow us. Uh, you know, we've got this handheld cam we're doing today. It's uh, this kind of a new innovation for us in uh, in streaming. Be yeah. great to get a wireless pack for that. So don't forget to click that subscribe button. Yeah, I'm actually going to go throw this on the charger right now because we've got 24 minutes. Fantastic. <laughs> 24 yeah. minutes left on the battery. All right, ladies and gentlemen, there's nothing we like less than dead air, so uh, we're going to treat you to a, uh, a demonstration of two people that are not very good at Buck Hunter. This is like uh, this is like when they bring the rodeo clowns out, right, to make everyone laugh in between the guys that actually know what they're doing. So uh, go ahead and enjoy that.
Okay.
All right, folks, we're going to uh, get a little interview here. We're still on our little break. I see some viewers kind of uh, left us. That's okay. Nothing's really going on. We didn't really uh, anticipate the uh, tournament going so quickly. We wanted to stretch this out as long as possible. Uh, and uh, so we decided to kind of give everyone a break, kind of let them take a little smoke break. As you can see on on screen, there's a little platter of cookies. People uh, taking a cookie break. Re-upping on beers. Uh, we got some great sponsors tonight. Um, a lot of hookups prize-wise, too, you know. Uh, Ten Barrel Brewing, uh, of course, Big Buck Hunter. Thanks, uh, you know, to 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 them for uh, posting this on their Facebook. Uh, I think when I looked, it was something like 40k likes. That's amazing. Uh, Fort George is another one of our sponsors tonight. Ecliptic Brewing, uh, Lua Rum Yum, and Breakside Brewing. Lots of alcohol sponsors. Because uh, beer is awesome and rum, rum's cool too. And I'm a tequila fan myself. Uh, looking out there on the floor, I see uh, a lot of happy faces. And that's right, Super Nintendo Chalmers. What's up? Welcome to the show. Thanks everyone for viewing. Uh, this has been great so far. Uh, really good turnout uh, physically and online. You know, typically uh, when we stream events like um, for uh, Super Smash Bros. and stuff, you know, uh, we don't we don't get a lot of people in the chat and everything, and it's kind of like ghostly, you know. And, and this has been great. So we uh, we've been talking about it, and we really want to uh, do this event again uh, constantly. Actually, maybe once a month. You know, um, we do have a lot of people that traveled uh, from all the way from a uh, place like San Francisco, all the way here to Portland, Oregon. Uh, and in case you're wondering what the weather's like, it's uh, beautifully raining <laughs> right now, of course. Uh, Looking on the floor, we got uh, Safari in the background there too, and that's actually a little mini tournament we're doing. Uh, if you look over to the right, you kind of on the table, you see this kind of lit lit up thing. That's actually uh, one of the big prizes. Uh, that is uh, a, um, a a deal you mount on the wall, and it's uh, well, how do you say? It's uh, it's like a. My gosh, I don't think I've had enough beers. It's one of those cool little light up things that say Big Buck HD. It's a sign. It's a light up sign. Jeez. All right. Uh, we're going to do some interviews here. We're going to actually get the camera on the floor. And we're going to have Emily, the event coordinator for this uh, tournament, uh, interviewing some folks uh, post match. And uh, starting to see people come back. I think we're about to start here. All right. And if you go to challenge.com and search Big Buck Tournament Showdown, today's date, you can see the bracket. You can uh, see all the people winning and losing. I think I'm going to actually go and uh, I got the uh, handheld camera charging up here. I think I'm going to pull it off the charger and go uh, walk up to the safari game going on right now. Looks like some good stuff.
All right, we're about to start again. And we have a gentleman passing out free samples. I believe he's with the Kraken team. All right, we've got our competitors as the action begins again. We'll go live to game one setup. Prepare for some big buck HD wild. Uh, yeah, that's right, Buttered Ghost. Uh, they, Emily was just telling us that they used an app for the, uh, the triple strike bracket. And um, even though they tested it yesterday, it, uh, it is not working on there and it's not connecting to its own server some nonsense like that but that's all right all the fun's right here in person at quarter world arcade in portland oregon settling for the third round this round we'll see our first actual eliminations going to be sending some people home this round and uh getting closer and closer to that grand prize winner did marco marco did you show them uh did you show them the prize did you get over there and, and show everyone the? Oh uh, yeah, you wanna? The light I'm gonna box take prize? the camera down to the prize right there. We'll, can you we'll, make it over there with our? Uh, yeah, I, I can make it over there without tripping. I think. Yeah, I, uh, with our, with I was our trying wired, to describe what it was. We got enough battery power left what, on, what on the old girl. What would you call that? What's that? The this prize. Thing you have? A light box, a marquee light box. Light box, jeez. Uh, yeah. I was calling it like a, a sign thingy. Okay. Sign thingy that works too. That's always a good one. So Marco's going to go over there and let everyone get a good look at it. Uh, I'll switch over that camera when he gets there. Sure, Marky. I like sign thingy. You know, it's an in-house creation, so we'll have to ask Kirby. He might, Maybe he wants to call it Kirby sign thingy. Let's see if he's gone there. There it is. That is a... That would look great in someone's home bar or den. Pretty exciting grand prize. I know we've also got uh, some gift certificates. I know there's a $50 gift certificate to Fort George Brewery in uh, Astoria floating around. Got some local gift certificates to some of the 10 Barrel, Breakside. Uh, all our great sponsors chipped in some swag. So we've got a lot of hats and t-shirts and that sort of thing. Saw some really nice winter hats, actually, from uh, 10 Barrel. Not sure who, who's going to get those, but... All right, we'll get a good shot of that beautiful light box. Yeah, looking looking real good. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll be right back because for those of you that have ever been to Quarter World, you know what that sound means. It Dinner. means my sandwich is ready. Well, you got a sandwich. What'd you get? What'd you get? I got that, uh, the burbs. It's like a, like a barbecue, barbecue yeah. chicken burger kind of thing. Oh, man. I'll let you know how it is. There's one. That's oh, awesome. no.
Oh, and that was that was a great game right there. Very nice, very nice. All right, let's go hop over to the second game. Let's see what they're all doing. Oh, we got barbecue chicken all day, burger form. We got burrito form. All right. picture time there. You gotta cherish these times. Ooh, Kirby. Kirby's my favorite. He's uh, gonna be on number three. That's the uh, one to the right over there. That's yeah, Kirby there. Uh, unfortunately for the camera's sake, the man on the left is very tall.
right. Get ready. Here we go. That's one. You got one. Yeah. Let's just hop to game two really quick, see what they're doing. All right, back to the main game right here. That's a great shot between the trees back there. The gentleman on the right hand screen right there, he came all the way from San Francisco. Amazing. I can't believe it. Sounds like uh, the bartenders have Thriller on repeat. Jeez. It's killing me. It's killing me inside. Yeah, that's Andrew. For you. Next players here. Nice. 
And hey, folks, just a reminder, uh, please hit follow on that thingy on the screen over there, however that stuff works. Whatever you kids do these days, I don't even know. All right, so we're picking uh, our animals here. Let's see, what do we got? Looks like uh, station one is, ooh, what's it gonna be? Ooh, very nice, very nice choice. And over in station two, we got Zach, my homie, good luck. Oh, Buckzilla, very nice. Sorry, right, let's check game one here. What are we doing over here? Yeah, right? Thriller, huh? And uh, just to kind of get back at chat there. Yeah, sorry. I had two games. Game sounds going at the same time. Gonna hop over in game two really quick here. No, we're not. Yeah, we are. Oh, very nice, very nice. And let's just. Very nice. What's the scores? Very nice, very nice. All right, and here's game one. Boom! Oh, we had a misfire there. Oh, uh, Rick roll, huh? Getting Rick rolled, we are. Oh, the kitty attacked. It's a, that's a mean meow. It's a mean meow right there. Popping a game two right over here. What are they doing? What are they doing over there? Shooting things they're not supposed to. There we go. That's one. There's another. There's one. We're gonna do a little bonus game here. Shoot them electric fishies. Looks like I lost my chair, huh? All right, what do we got going on? Oh, we're just bouncing around. We're in a bonus game here. All on right, Station closing one. that one out, huh? Anyone get kicked out yet? Oh, I'm sure. Oh, we got something going on at two also. Let's pop over there real quick. Oh. 
Oh, that's not. This isn't the time you want to be shooting a zo a Dozak. A Zodak. Oh. Get a look at that guy's shirt right behind Zach. Just says Doe. I like it. Alright, here we go. Bonus round. Shooting the flying plops. There we go. There we go. All over our faces. Go, Zach. There we go. Let's take a look at that final score. Uh, Zach just not able to get it done. We got Naf Nafitz. Nafitz gets it. We're going to go down to the floor right now and uh, talk to the son of a bitch beat me. Turn it on. Huh? Yeah, you're on. Yeah? Huh? Fuck this. <laughs> hey, how about that? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Compelling, Son of a gun. compelling commentary from a uh, wonderfully, wonderfully I'm loquacious. Yeah. Hey Marco, let's uh, let's pick a, a guy that doesn't have his middle finger up next time. <laughs> of course, we're kidding. We love that. Not quite the interview I was looking for, but you know it works. You know it's it's not always the interview you want, but it's the one you deserve. That's what they say, right? And that's that's the one Win we deserve. Some, lose some, huh? That's yeah. what you get for cramming a camera in someone's yeah. face right after yeah. they lose yeah. a big that tournament. That felt like mad. a really weird episode of Cops. Now, let's see what Emily has to say here. We have Selena and Christina up here on Machine One. Andrew and Megan on Machine Two. And Elisa and Gage on Machine 3. Alright folks, there you have it. Take a look here at Control and wait for everyone to get in their spots. Of course, thanks again to our sponsors for all the great prize packs our uh, contestants are going to enjoy tonight. Everyone that enters is getting a little swag pack of something, going home with a koozie or something like that. Probably a sticker and a button. So thanks again. Sponsors are really what, what make these, uh, these sort of events possible. I didn't quite get you there, Marco. What was that now? What was that? Oh, Eye of the Tiger. Blaring, blaring so beautifully in the background. Oh, uh, yeah, they got the appropriate... It's always the, the appropriate music here. Spot. Yeah. There's one. 
one. There's another. Oh no. Oh no. Not another. Shooting a doe. That's not what you want to do. Megan coming out hot on, on board number two there. Megan, oh, I feel for you. Really the worst feeling in Big Buck Hunter, isn't it? Nothing you can do but just stand there and watch him clean up. Checking on Ken and Kel over here up on setup one now. Jaguar. He don't like you. That's a leopard, right? And that might be it. That might have just given the last little edge that Kitten needed to get ahead in this contest. I'll tell you what, 11 bulls to 12. It's a, this is a good matchup. Doesn't take much to get that lead, though. That's one. There's one. Yeah. There's another. Got another. You nailed it. So I'm getting those faraway ones. That's going to make up for a bit. Yeah, look at that. All right, all right. Might be one of the tightest matches we've seen yet today, Marco. It's uh, it's really coming down to the bonus on this one. Electric yield bonus.
looks like Kitten's gonna take the take the prize on that one. That was one heck of a match. Hate to see anybody have to go home empty-handed after that. Yeah, it looks like that gets us through this round. All right, and we're just resetting, resetting brackets here. We'll have the next contestants announced in just a moment. There you have it, folks. Our next round of contestants are announced. We're going to go live to uh, our main setup one here. And uh, we're going to get out of the way and let you watch some big buck action between some, uh, some of the top contestants here in Portland. We're really getting, getting late in the bracket here. There's a lot of talent on the floor. Enjoy. Ooh, this is one heck of a match going on here. We're going to send uh, Marco over to set up three that we don't have uh, directly. Yep. Change battery pack. Oh, you good? It's okay. We're going to send Marco over to set up three where we don't have one. We've got some. Yeah, our batteries are so We've got a, 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 tight, uh, a tight match between uh, our in house favorite Kirby. Well, that's not what we wanted to see. All right, let's just go back to game one and enjoy this one. Dude, these batteries, all the batteries are toast. That's right. All the batteries are toast, Marco says. So don't forget to click that subscribe button and uh, support the stream. We can do plenty more events like this. 
and have fun things like batteries. <laughs> <laughs> And seriously, if you don't subscribe, just at least remember to follow so you'll get uh, notifications. We're planning on doing uh, Big Buck Hunter on a somewhat regular basis, at least quarterly. So uh, like and follow us, and uh, you'll know when we're up and live, and you can join the fun. All right, guys, we're going to go over to setup two here. Bit of a tighter match. Really coming down with the wire. There's one. That's one. Got it. You nailed it. You got it. You nailed it. Boy, oh boy, I'll tell you what, I don't believe in violence against dogs, but if there's a dog in my life that's pissed me off the most, it's that goddamn duck hunter dog, I'll tell you what. Yeah, I prefer this dog. This is a way nicer pup. He doesn't, like, mock me and, and laugh at me. He, he encourages me, if anything. That dog laughed at me through my childhood. Yeah, I know, right? I turned out okay, man, but, you know, there's some people out there. Well, speaking about turning out okay, <laughs> the Feds gets the win there at the end. Very nice. Moving on to the next round. I'm showing everyone your beautiful face. We got nothing going on here. You see Emily back there making her announcements? Yeah, that's right. People want to see the they want to see behind the cut inside baseball, you know? I wasn't uh, at the ladies tournament in October, but I'm wearing the, the thing though. But he supports. Ooh, there we oh. go. Now we're getting ready. Oh. Now things are getting fun. Someone's had some of uh, Pappy's Jug. You know, <laughs> someone's been hitting that Pappy's Julius a little too hard. Right, that's what it was. You know, I think I'm going to have to get me a, a beer here. Out of one of our many sponsors, Tan Barrel and Fart George and uh, Ecliptic I like Brewing. how you can think of those just right off the top of your head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> How do you say break side? Break side brewing. They're awesome. Uh, we we kid, but we do love our sponsors. They make this events happen. <laughs> yeah, and, uh, I'm, a, I'm an shout asshole. Out to I'm them. sorry. <laughs> can we can we get can we get a host cam on you too, Ryan? I feel I feel singled out here. People need to watch this because this is Moose. All He's right. both of the Moose Masters of the Northwest. Nightmare. All right, here we go. You heard him. Got some supportful fans. Moose Masters of the Northwest. Nope. 
Pick a spot. Not bad, everybody. There's one. Got one. Got another. Yeah. Got another. Yeah. Hitting that level or we're just clearing out those sites. Quick. Such a shame to kill all those skydiving badgers. And there you have it, folks. Catfish advances, and Van Who grabs a cozy and goes on homesy, if you know what I mean. You know, I gotta say, I love working at a place that has two bars. Two bars, you know, one's full. Go to the other one, not so full. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. Don't uh, don't tell everyone about the secret bar. That's uh, that's, <laughs> yeah, that's where we get our drinks. La lounge. It's popping tonight, man. Lounge is packed. Yeah, it's, it's packed over there. Friday night at Quarter World, huh? Friday. Friday Saturday night. <laughs> yeah, it's like, oh man, I know I'm I'm messed up, but shit. <laughs> yeah. Saturday night at Quarter World. December 7th. What happened December 7th in the past? Let's see. 1941, Pearl Harbor. Pearl Harbor Day today. Was it really? Yeah, I should know that. I was in the Navy. Well, that's that's uh, interesting to know. Interesting yeah. To know. Any other fun and uplifting facts about today? Um. Any other mass, uh, mass attacks on our, our country or a uh, little... Giant. giant loss of life you want to you wanna have us think about oh, while, we're, while we're having fun oh. here playing video games with? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to sip this beer here real quick. <laughs> on the first machine up on the stage, we have Kirby Anderson. And yeah. On machine two, we have Dave Schaefer and Melinda. Right. And then we have Elisa and Mason on Machine 3. All right, there you have it. We've got our contestants stepping up to the main machine. We've got House Favorite yeah. Kirby. 
And uh, good luck, Kirby, man. Uh, the guy that's not Kirby. Not saying I, I have a bias. I, I just don't know his name. I only care about Kirby, honestly. You know? Yeah. It's, it's Kirby or nothing. There you go, Kirby or bus. Yeah. Right. See how. I just want to say I uh, I personally wiped down all of the machines and the guns today so these players could have that advantage, you know, and, and uh, I think it goes a long way. See how he's comfortably holding it to his face yeah. and not in fear yeah. of getting some kind of MRSA or anything? That's, that's good of you. Yeah, there's been a, I feel like, I don't know how many sports you follow, but there's a flu that almost took down the entire NFL apparently, so. Oh, yeah? It's, uh, it's important. Important to disinfect and wash your hands this time of year. Sounds like a case of the Mondays or something. Yeah. Cover your filthy mouth when you sneeze. Ain't nobody want to breathe that. Here we go. Irish elk. Going. We got to go back in time. Drunk elk. Sorry. I'm just now. Now I'm just reaching for straws. There. All right. Kind of, this is the kind of action we're going to be looking at now, right? Split down the middle, fighting over the dangerous trophy. That was, a, that was amazing. See how I just did that slide right into the camera? All right. Nathets and Kirby. Hey, look at you, we look at these two competitors. Do you think? Do you think the height is an advantage? A height advantage there? I think a reach, maybe. I don't, know if it, I don't know if it gives an edge or not. Ooh. Maybe it's a disadvantage. You're hunching over more. Yeah, you know, you should see uh, Kirby's stance, man. He's got that... Uh, we should bust out the uh, the handy cam That's there true. and get that it's stance. True. Does. It's a very wide stance. Very pronounced gait. For those of you that enjoyed the uh, dog show recently. Oh man, that's that's the kind of realm that'll just put you down in a tournament like this. Cannot afford that kind of mistake. And uh, as mentioned, we're just gonna. Uh, There we are, the, the, the as promised stance cam. See, so you got that, Kirby's got that wide, wide base. You know, that uh, helps handle the kickback from the, from the light guns. I'll go back to the game here for you. That was a good shot, yeah, yeah. I, I think we got the point across. Kirby 
cleans up handily on that one. Very nice. A little advance. See that final score. <laughs> Give there that, it is. That, that that cut over real quick to the bonus on number two. Let you guys get a look at this. We got a pretty good match going here as well. I like this bonus. Did you know that there's actually Elk and Buck on that pirate boat that they're fighting? Uh, I, that's interesting. That makes a lot more sense. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You didn't know that. That's how they got them to the New World. Little known fact. That's not true. <laughs> Big Buck of the Caribbean. Yeah. That's another little known fact that's not true, is that Pirates invented Buck Hunter HD. Yeah, a long time ago, but uh, the scurvy kind of yeah. got the project not to lift off. And Out on the ship for months, nothing to do, and they said, hey, let's invent this, uh, this yeah. first-person shooter. You know, we'll Buck have wooden hunting. teeth. It was great. So say thanks to a pirate sometime. What is it? National what? Rehab Vodka Day? Rhubarb Vodka Day. Uh, for this round. All right. After this I'm going to go celebrate that right now. Break. I don't know if we have rhubarb. We got some infused vodka back there. Our machine one is myself and Matt Peterson. Machine two is Scott and Andrew. And on machine three, we have Stefan and Chrissy. Very nice. The competition is heating up, folks. Oh, and we're actually going to switch on over to one because we've got our own master of game, master of ceremonies, host of the show, Emily. Competing on rig one. And here's a here's another fact. There, machine in three. If you look down there, that's a, that's a married couple actually. They're going toe to toe. Oh, all right. Yeah. Now we'll see. Fortunately, we don't have a a live feed on machine three. No, we don't. No, we don't. I could I could uh, get the the camera rolling here. Little good luck support there from uh, from Zach. Pick a spot. There's one. That's one. You got it. There's another. You got it. There's another. Too, you know. There's one. Oh, no. you nailed it. There's another. Yeah, there's another. A lot of games going on here right now. We got another contest over here on two, and of course we've got. Our married couple over on uh, three here. We're keeping an eye on. Don't worry. Watch that for a minute. We got set up one with Emily down there in the corner. We're keep an eye on at the same time. Reload! 
Ouch, that round's gotta hurt. That one stings, I'm sure. Come on, Emily, we believe in you. There we go, yeah! That's one. Yeah, you got it! Let's check in on number two, see what's going on over there. We also got a bonus coming down here. Setup one looks pretty settled, so we'll see what the score looks like over here. There you have it, folks. Some pretty decided wins here in this round. Some people definitely going home without a doubt, taking their koozie and hitting the road. I don't know if they get a koozie. I'm just assuming they do. You a koozie man, Marco? You use koozies oh, on, oh, on yeah. the regular? I, I use uh, koozies as wallets and uh, hand warmers. Uh, they're great. That's I, uh, sad. That's really a sad story. <laughs> they're free usually. They're great. All right, looks like everyone's finished up on their game. We still only got when you're out of Crown Royal bags, right? <laughs> hey, don't, dude. You can put a <laughs> lot of cool stuff in those, man. <laughs> like socks. Uh, I mean, yeah, I pack my lunch in a Crown Royal bag typically. Uh, you know, such a <laughs> such an insight into the the life of our uh, of our. I feel host like here. Charlie Day or something. Uh, yeah, Crown Royal. <laughs> life. I'm only half on the on the feed because it would look right if we were both here. Oh, oh but then oh, we're kind of. Oh, oh. You can't tell in real life this is a, an uncomfortable close. Yeah, this is this is this is who we're listening to now. Oh, that's smoke break for me, ladies and gentlemen. All right, and uh, I'm gonna take a fresh air break because I don't. Uh, yeah, I, s I say we leave the mics on so they can hear the lovely soundtrack mm -hmm. that uh, Twitch will probably mute uh, later in our <laughs> Maybe maybe. <laughs> Try and peek out there on the camera. Choose what games they want to play next time they come into the wonderful Quarter World Arcade exactly. in Portland, Oregon. And uh, make sure you hit subscribe so we get that wireless pack, folks. That's right. I could be giving you a tour right now, you know? Like and follow so you know when we're on. And uh, <laughs> we'll be back in just a few minutes. Sorry, I'm just money hungry. Oh. Koozie Mittens. Who is that? <laughs> I definitely will be. Just I like to go full uh, full penguin mode when I wear them.
There it is. All right. You heard it here, everybody. We've got one minute for everyone to get to their positions. The bracket is restarting. The competition is heating up. And we are still fighting with our bracketing software. So there's that. Let's go live to set up one and see what's going on over there. Nobody. Everyone's having too much fun with their retro hazes and loose hitos. Somebody brought a little dessert tray down there. Scott and Elisa are going to be up on the main stage. Kirby and Melinda on two. All right. Check out the revelers here as we get started again. Some some Kirby game face there. The eye of the tiger. Oh, there's the, there's middle finger guy again. Oh, charge the battery pack. All right, let's get back to our main competitors here. Of course, we have one. We have two. Looks like we're going for elk on on setup one. In on number two here, we get see about, what they decide uh, to go hunting for. Let's see, for a charge, Oof. for like a 20 minute charge, we get about 10 seconds. So, all right, let's all back right. on the charger again. So, we got Moose Pick going down on one, Elk on, or Moose on two, Elk on one. Here we go. Those are some game faces there. Man, who is just killing it? Yeah, not bad, not bad. There's one, you got it, you nailed it. You got it. There's another. You nailed it. I like whenever I uh, shove the camera in Kirby's face, he pretends uh, it's not there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> kind of, but he, he kind of does his best like uh, Blue Steel, you know? He does. He's <laughs> That's why we got to get him his sh own show, man. Kirby sucks. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Kirby sucks. I mean, he doesn't... No, he, Kirby, Kirby sucks at losing at video games. There you go. Perfect. <laughs> that is... Okay. We got it. I don't know uh, if we have any. There's one. That's one. Ooh. Ooh. Nail. Got another. Yeah. Got another. Looks good. There's one. Got one. 
Ooh, and that's all she wrote. That's a big lead. That's a big lead for this game. All right, on to that bonus round. I don't want to check in on Kirby here in a minute. He kind of he hit a dough, I think. He, well, let's, he let's don't say, got his gun let's out. Let's take a look over there. See what's going on. Oh, there, there. he goes. There's one. Oh no. Oh, again. There's another. You nailed it. Yeah. You got him. Kirby all. shooting does against the champ twice that in a is, row. That is not a competitor you can go around shooting does against. <laughs> You know oh, I mean? dough. Oh, oh, dough. <laughs> that dough. I feel like I didn't make that up. I feel like someone's just yelling right now, like, you didn't make that up. I don't know. You heard it here first, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, here we go. I mean, I'll shoot a skunk, but what would a badger Ooh. ever do to anyone? No, it's just, look at that lead. The beaver state here, I feel like this is inappropriate. Oh, it goes to Mal. Handedly. Kirby, so sorry to see you go home. Yeah. It looks like up here on one. Uh, yeah, we're getting that next then round. Then you close that up. out. All right, let's take a look here. As you can see, both of our setups are, uh, are in between matches right now. Number three back there over my shoulder still kind of going. We don't have a setup on that. We can bring you the results here in just a moment. You know, I wonder how that side tournament's going. Yeah, we should check in on that high score. I see, I see someone back there trying their luck at it right now. Yeah, that's uh, that's cat, I think, on on that kitten. machine or kitten. Kitten. Meow. Some kind of meow. Yeah, I remember that. Oh, I, then we got Andrew up on uh, the third station there from San Francisco. Float all the way over here. All right. I wonder how he's been doing. Uh, give it about another six hours. We might have about five minutes of battery on that handy cam. Yeah, we can go over and check it out again. <laughs> yeah, That'll yeah, be great. <laughs> Once again, don't don't forget to subscribe. Yeah. Follow and like. Support the stream. Yeah, definitely give a follow. Uh, that would be rad. <clears throat> yeah, we're getting pretty deep in the bracket here now. Uh, only a handful of competitors left or so. And just a little shout out to all of our sponsors tonight. Ten Barrel Brewing, hooking us up. And of course, uh, you know, we got Raw Thrills Play uh, Mechanic right there. Mechanics, they hooked us up too with some uh, some social media. Fort George beer. Fort George, fantastic beer. Fort George. I'm actually that, drinking uh, pub beer right now. Yeah, that's City of Dreams. I'll tell you what, we can't even keep it in around here. Ecliptic Brewing. Another great beer. Uh, and uh, Kahlua. Rum. Kraken. Huh? Kraken rum. Oh, yeah, it does say Kraken. Yeah. 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 Which you knew. I never passed the third grade. The and yeah. uh, Breakside Brewing. Thanks for calling yeah. me out, Ryan. What did, what did, I didn't see. I was looking at the prize packs. I didn't see. Uh, what did Kraken What did Kraken donate to the... Kraken donated to the a, a gentleman with a tray and some tasters, and he promptly oh. took off once oh. uh, the buck started flying. Yeah, I would, too. He, he didn't look like he was ready for... Uh, he was not, yeah. For the, the revelry, <laughs> as you would. That's This isn't for the faint of heart, folks. Right. Not well, at all. As much as I'm sure you guys like looking at us, let's uh, get up here to our, our top setup. And uh, tune in the action. Tune in. Tune in and tune out, right? My kids probably don't know why. What, what do you mean tune in? Like <laughs> cartoons? <laughs> don't forget to set your set your recorders. Yeah. So you can uh, tape this program and yeah. watch it again later. You know, I'm actually having <laughs> an issue with my VHS. Uh, I'm going to have to get a tape cleaner. Yeah. 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 Anyway. Which is a problem because you got to get a time machine first. Right. And go back to 87 <laughs> and then get a head cleaner. <laughs> heard all the head cleaner off. got used up in the 90s, I heard. Probably, yeah. <laughs> Kids used to huff that stuff. <laughs> yeah. Watching uh, Independence Day so many times, you know. <laughs> oh, Independence Day, that's a great one. Wish we had that over here for our Tuesday pinball. Isn't that isn't Independence Day? Isn't that a documentary? 
I think there is a, a, a documentary, but the one people were referring to is the Will Smith movie. Right, that's a documentary. That <laughs> actually happened. I think so. I'm not in sure. 96, I want to say. I tell my kids it did. Yeah. I'm going to show them Independence Day. Yeah, right. Tell them, <laughs> tell them that right. was Oklahoma City. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Too hot. Too <laughs> hot of a take. <laughs> Too soon. <laughs> I'd vote for Bill Pullman. Isn't that who the president was in that? Hell yeah, When he gave dude. that speech, I'd be down there. At the dude. Just, I choke up a little bit yeah, every time I hear that. You know, you know? Up there with Braveheart. Yeah, for sure. The wedding the, the wedding is Godfather, right? It's another good speech. Yeah, that was decent, huh? Yeah, that, was a, that wasn't bad. <laughs> All right, let's get back to the buck hunting action. Don't forget to tune in Thursdays to our uh, our movie podcast, <laughs> <laughs> where we watch documentaries like uh, They Live and uh, <laughs> uh, uh, What's another documentary? Uh, Space Jam. That's a documentary. That is. That's a true story about the uh, the Olympic team, right? And how they won. Yeah. They beat the Russians. About one man's journey and finding a new career after basketball. It's fantastic. But ends up going back to basketball within another dimension. That it's Bugs great. Bunny gets me every time. Yeah. I heard, he, I heard he's a jerk in real life. Bugs Bunny? Yeah. Real. <laughs> Stays in his trailer. Yeah, he's, he's got that Tom Cruise kind of attitude going sure, on. Sure, I can see it. I can see it. <laughs> All right, we'll let you guys listen to the game now. There's one. You got one. You nailed it. There's another. Uh oh. Yeah. Oh. The man on the left. I actually stepped on his toes a little bit earlier uh, on accident. Uh, he was nice though. He's nice about it. He just gently kind of shoved me down to the ground and yeah. <laughs> okay, you know, well, he's in a competition. He can't be taking his toes out right before the end. Uh, uh, there, he got it. You got him. You got him all. You know, when you're when you're down big, sometimes you just gotta go for those shots that uh. Yeah. You know, you know, you might hit a doe, but you've just got to take that risk because, uh, right? You know, you're so far down. What are you gonna do? Or a swing what, big? Or that's not a, that's a female antelope or something. I I, I don't watch uh, the Geography Channel. You watch a lot of documentaries. <laughs> <laughs> bonus. Oh, this is again. We now, so I know for a fact there's bucks and does on this pirate ship shooting loaded, at us. Loaded to the gills yeah. with uh, illegal aliens. Illegal alien bucks and does and elk. Yeah, let's clear that up. Okay. All right, we're swinging about just for fun here. A little known fact I just made up, but they used to hunt bucks with cannons. Some people don't know that. Yeah, it's uh, the best way to preserve the, the pellets, apparently. The meat, really, because then you, you don't have little pellets in there. You just have exactly. to pulver, <laughs> pulverize its tender eyes. <laughs> uh, that singed sheer look is uh, what people like to go for back in the 16, 17, 1800s. All right, big win there. Big Very win nice. there. All right, and then... We're about to announce the next set of people. Looks like it. Once again, thanks so much for joining us. We're here at Porter right World Arcade here. in Portland, Oregon for the inaugural Big Bug right, HD Wild Tournament Showdown. These matches are going to get intense. Up on the stage at Machine One, we have Elisa and Andrew. 
Machine two, we have Melinda and Matt Peterson. There you go. We're down to two machines. Moving through the bracket quickly. Let's go to number one. Hey, that was great. Look at here with the announcements. Ready as a yeah. picture. I just want to say this is a great headset, by the way. I feel like I'm wearing uh, gummy bears on my head. It's interesting. Yeah, <laughs> I feel. It doesn't breathe though. My ears got hot real quick. <laughs> my girlfriend was wearing them the other day, and she threw them over her head because she claimed adventure. that it felt like human skin, and she didn't like it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, I guess I wouldn't like my ears enveloped in Yeah, skin. it's like some Ed Bean headset. All right. Speaking in on two over here. I'm just curious what the... We'll check in again, see what they're shooting. All right. My favorite part, when people type in their names so I know what to call them. All right. AMF. I'm Pick guessing that stands uh, for the same thing as the drink. Is the drink? Uh, yeah. I, I think it might be a coincidence. <laughs> I There's one. There's one. Looks, like, looks like over here on two, they're going for L. Yeah. You nailed it. Ooh, I think Andrew took that one, right? Yeah. Ooh, barely. Barely. And uh, to all our listeners out there, if you're hearing that, a little bit of a buzz. We're yeah. hearing it too. We're not happy about it. We're not. But, uh, uh, it's we actually fired our sound guy tonight over it. It's true. It's true. Yeah. He won't be working in this town again. Yeah, never. But uh, we don't want to. We don't want to jump into that cabinet and start tearing things apart right now while we're in the middle of a tournament. So we're just gonna live with that buzz for tonight. Yeah. And uh, learn next for show. next time. Next show. Yep. We'll have that crisp Blu-ray sound for you guys. Ooh, that's wow. a big one. That's a tie turner there. Yeah. There you go. Amp. Dangerous trophy. That's one. That was fun. Ooh, Mosk is not happy about that last round. Coming out fierce. Taking out. That dangerous trophy. That was a great shot. That was that was close. Yeah, that, that was, was good. Two, that was yeah. quite the two rounds there. Huh? It's really fun watching uh, the people shoot and uh, watching their muzzles uh, move in sync together, and yeah, people yeah. trying to kind of take over the other person's side of the screen. You know. It's always been one of my more favorite things, you know, watching pinball too and all the streams we do, like getting that opportunity to watch someone's facial expressions and body language when they're playing is always a a fun element of this. I know I look like a fool when I play games. I kick my legs like a mule, you know. I'm so excited. Oh, there's Pappy. There he is. He should probably shouldn't be driving. Oh yeah, Pappy's gone. Okay. That's alright. Good. Good, good, great. You know, he wasn't. Well, no, in fact, he went to jail for 10 years for that moonshine. Yeah, he did. Blinded a bunch of kids. And that's actually the same tornado from the movie Tornado. They actually hired that tornado right. for this. And by tornado, you mean the documentary Twister, right? Yeah. With Bill, Ellen Hunt? Bill Paxton? Yeah, I love that documentary. That's great. Little known fact I just made up, elk do not like twisters and will actively run in the opposite direction. They're actually harmless, folks. They just kind of pick you up and put you down. Look at that score, 300 points, my God. Oh, wow. When it comes down to it, it comes down to it. All right, what's going on? Oh, we're not. Peeking on over on two yeah. here. 
round out this. Clicking. Right? Oh, Mesmerizing. Alright, well, I think this is the end of this round, right? I think so. Oh, it's party time. Ooh, Mel ekes it out. And I think we have ourselves a. Uh, I, I could be wrong, but I think we have ourselves a, uh, a, a championship match now. Yeah, I mean, I think there. I think. And then there were two? Shoot, yeah, I think, man. Check in here. Yeah. Well, that was pretty great. We got some uh, some little pins given to us here. Let's see if we can get that. Let's see if we can get that up in the. I bucked around at Quarter World, so that's pretty fun. Put that on a backpack. That's or great. Hat, hat or something. I'm so upset. My drink uh, didn't get made. Adios, Mother Bucker. I mean that. Come on. I mean, it was, it was a tough list, though. You got to you got to think with uh, with the, the <laughs> Musito and the. Uh, I mean, yeah, they're cool. They're great. The I one? get it. Yeah. Kudu you know. Libre, <laughs> yeah. Kudu Libre, Buckzilla Bowl. Pappy's so did you see what? this bowl? This bowl that they have? No. It's a. Uh, oh, the cookie thing. Oh uh, no, it's a fish bowl. It's a, it's got to be. That's this. the Pappy's jug thing. No, that's the Buckzilla. Oh, that's a. It's oh. got to be this big, huge. Yummy. A quart of liquor. See you tomorrow. Wow. You know what I mean? I love throwing up. Give me one of those. <laughs> Four players left, everybody. Right Let's now, listen in. Melinda is in first place with zero strikes. Andrew is in a close second place with only one strike. Elisa and Stefan both have two strikes, so we'll see what happens after this round. Right now we have Elisa and Stefan up on the stage. And Andrew and Melinda on machine two. All right, Elisa and Stefan, Andrew and Melinda. We got a couple of great matches here uh, coming up for this round. We're going to go in directly to set up one. I think we're just going to park there for, uh, for this round. Let you catch that action real time. Prizes for many of you. Everyone that competed gets a prize. So please stick around until the end. We have prizes for everyone. Thank you. Pretty as a postcard. Four, four people left in the tournament. Yeah. Here, here's our finalists. We got. Oh boy. Our two there. Our two there. Welcome to elk we got elk on number one and Irish elk on number two. Oh, that's a great shot. Yeah, that's uh, so behind the scenes. What the hell is that? Lord, that's All our right. passed out cam. Our, our cameraman nice. 
had too many. Yeah, he's like syllables. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pick a spot. He's All sleeping right. it off in the uh, the Star Wars battle pod that's down right now. That's why it's down. <laughs> that's why it's out of order. There's one. That's one. folks kind of winding down here that was a great last match very 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 nice uh, we don't got anything else going on right now so we're just gonna go uh, look at the crowd here
up on the stage, we have Melinda and Elisa. And on machine two, we have Andrew and Matt. Again, stick around till the end. We have swag and prizes for everyone here. Please stick around to the end and support your other buck hunters. All right, there you have it. Whittling down these three strikes for everybody. This is one heck of a matchup here on the stage, guys. I've been waiting to see this one for a little bit of a while. Stall out on. Pick a spot. I just want to give a shout out real quick to uh, some of the new followers we've had. Uh, Swizzle Fish, thank you so much for following. Federico Reed, you've been awesome all night in the chat. Thank you for following and sticking around and hanging out with us. M. Brucey11, thanks for that follow. Brucey. We got Dre PKP. Forgot about Dre. Yeah, right. And uh, we got a little kitty pick. Let's see. Then Santos Zozoso. Thanks for that follow. Santos Zozoso. All right. All right. All right. Something like that. Taco Dog 40K. Thanks for that follow. And Jar Werewolf. Very rad, folks. Uh, can't do this without y'all. I mean, well, we can, but we don't want to. It wouldn't be as fun. Wouldn't be as fun. So thanks for uh, sticking around, everybody. Bonus. And we're just going to go to host here to split screen so we can check in with both games and uh, see who are, who's going home out of this round, who's sticking around. All right. Oh, there we go. Got to love those hugs. Great community. Good, yeah, good sportsmanship. Looks like we got Moss. AMF. Yeah. With the surprise Been killing it. Way. 
And now we sit and wait for the next round. The last round, right? Uh, I'm not sure because of the three strike element. I think there might still be some people that uh, I, th I think there's still some people that need to get their their third strike. So I think we're kind of working Good. through that. I've never, uh, I'll be honest, I've never been part of a three-strike tournament. I've only done double elimination. Yeah, totally. Um, I mean, it's all good for me. That means I get to drink more beer. So, you know, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm happy. Don't, I don't see too many people uh, complaining about hanging out. All right. so. Thanks, well, Ten Barrel Brewing, for making pub beer. It's my favorite. That is a good one. That is a good one. See Emily hu hustling around, getting ready. Assuming we're going to have announcements of our next competitors here pretty quickly. Just to catch you up, we're going to go in on setup one, which is the only setup currently playing games because we have Melinda and Elisa one more time. Both have two strikes. Somebody here is going home, and somebody here is going on to face Andrew in the final round. to how this one's going to go. That one really highlighting what a difference it can make when that buck is far away.
Ooh, getting those far away bucks, that's going to help. Look at that. Look at the difference there. Really coming down to it. Gets the dangerous trophy. That was a that was a deciding round, possibly there. Ooh. Sometimes that's all it takes. Have it, folks. Couldn't have been closer till the very last sight. No losers in that one. Fantastic competitors. Everyone's going home with something. And that brings us to our final round, which will get started here shortly. Find out who the first inaugural champion of the Quarter World Big Buck HD Wild Tournament Showdown will be. All right, everyone. We have your final. This is the moment we have all been waiting for. Again, stick around and support Melinda and Andrew as they come up on machine one. Andrew will be picking first, but we have swag for all of you. Good luck, have fun to all of our competitors. Thank you everyone for coming out. We had such a blast with you tonight. We hope you come out next quarter when we have this again. Again, good luck, Melinda and Andrew. And just to let everyone out there know what's going on. So right now, this is our final round. However, Andrew only has one strike, while Melinda has two. So if Melinda wins, she will need to win a second time. So Melinda needs back-to-back -back wins to take the championship here from Andrew. Andrew only having one strike and her having two. He only needs to win one game. Let's get into it.
See what we have here, folks. Oh, and by a hair. Could not have been closer. It looks like we have a champion, ladies and gentlemen. Indeed. Let's go down to the floor for the excitement. There you have it. We'll have an official announcement here in just a moment. Can you see everyone celebrating? Thank you so much, everyone, for watching. Thank you, everyone, for your in-person for being here for the first right, inaugural showdown. Let's tune into our, uh, our winner's announcement Andrew here. on his win of the first ever Big Buck Tournament Showdown at Quarter World. We are going to do a prize ceremony now. Andrew, Melinda, Elisa, and Matt Peterson, please report to the stage. <laughs> Once again, everyone out there, thanks for viewing. We got our prizes being given out. Pretty exciting stuff. Thanks for being here. Don't forget to follow and subscribe. It helps us out more than you can imagine. Like we got some some white elephant style uh, prize negotiations going on over here. All right, the side tournament is going to go for about another thirty minutes. So, any players who were playing the entire time who wanted a chance, go ahead. You have another thirty minutes to play Big Buck World. We are going to give away some prizes now. Melinda's big prize, the Big Buck World Marquee, or Andrew's big prize, I'm so sorry. The Big Buck World Marquee will be going home with him via the airplane. Yay! It's a hell of a carry-on, but Andrew, this Big Buck Marquee is all yours. We've got t-shirts for everyone else, we've got swag for everyone else. Everyone has their cash payouts, I'm going to just start handing stuff out. Once you get your prize, please stick around and let's take a picture with all of our prizes for our sponsors. What a fantastic event. 
inaugural Big Buck HD Wild Tournament show down here at Portal World Arcade is coming to a close. You can see those fantastic prizes. Those right there are actually uh, Maker's Mark socks. So Maker's Mark socks going out to all of our contestants tonight. Got some pretty great shirts there. Come over here real quick and thank all of our sponsors. Of course, Big Bunk HD, Raw Thrills, and Play Mechanics for their hard work of putting together this game that we love so much. I'd also like to thank Ten Barrel Brewing, Fort George in Astoria, Kraken Spiced Rum, Breakside Brewing here in lovely Portland, Oregon. For those of you watching here in town, we always have at least two, sometimes three Big Buck Hunters here at Boy World Arcade. Come on down and uh, enjoy the games. 1,500 square feet of retro games and pinball. Open six days a week. again everybody thanks for viewing thanks for coming out what a fantastic event i know i had a blast from all of us at quarter world to all of you out there charge your battery packs it's very important and uh like us and subscribe to us keep your eye on our social media we've got all kinds of fun events streaming here on twitch and in real life thank you so much everyone have a good weekend Keep bucking.